hi there everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new so in today's video i will be unboxing my boxycharm premium box for the month of august you know that's right yeah <laughs> i i'm lost like seriously in months and dates and i think a lot of us are so yeah so if you're interested in seeing this um please keep on watching <music> Okay, you guys, so this is my box charm box for the month of August. It costs me $35 a month. And they also have a smaller box, which is $25 a month. And also that box has like, I think four to five full size items. This one here should have about six to seven full size items, if I am correct not sure yeah okay, so let's just um open this up and see what's in here i actually didn't see what it's in this box i usually love to see spoilers and you know try to have an idea of what i might get so let's see what's in here oh i haven't opened it i hope it has a little paper that tells you the prices and stuff yes it does because sometimes it doesn't and it's like really so yeah so the Theme of the box is uh, boxy charm glam vibes only. Ooh, nice. I kind of like the vibe this thing has going on. Yeah, so let's see the first item in here that I get. Ooh, okay. Ooh, Marc Jacobs. Ooh, I have never tried. I've heard good things about that, that this brand, but I never tried. This is a Marc Jacobs Youth Quake. It says it's a hydro full texturizing gel cream. Ooh, okay, so let's see right here. It says, have it all. This multitasking mo moisturizer has the perfect combination of moisturizing and retexturizing results. Why bother rehydrating dead skin cells? Smooth away rough texture and reveal a fresh surface that's ready to receive major moisture magnitude. Oh my God, there's something on that. I do have quite textured skin, so... I am very intrigued to see how this works. Ooh, this is, this feels like such a like a high-end brand. I've never tried my Marc Jacobs, if I am correct. I don't think so. Um, yes. Okay, and he has a little cover thing. Ooh, that smells good. Let me just get a little bit here. Oh, that feels so soft and so smooth. Oh, and once you blend that out, it literally has no smell. But then again, I could be wrong because I have bad sense of smell. Like, I don't have the strongest of that in my hand. So, so smooth. Okay, I can't wait to try this out. Nice, we're starting off good, you guys. Ah, okay, next item. It's a ice roller for your skin, overworked, sensitive skin. Kitsch. Kitsch. Is that how you? Kitsch. <laughs> Ice roller. I don't. I. That's the brand. I really don't know if I'm pronouncing that that right. I'm. I might not. I might be mispronouncing that so wrong. But anyways, it's. I guess it's like a roller thing for your skin. It says it helps. Let's see what it's. How this item helps says the ice roller is your new at home facial made with high quality surgical stainless steel. It helps calm inflammation, increase blood and circulation, and alleviate sore muscles, tension, and headaches. Ooh. Recommended daily use for the best results. Okay, um, I kind of have something similar like this, I believe, that I received from a box of a while ago, which is somewhat here saved so i'm not i'm not gonna keep this um i might just save it and maybe give it to a family member or something you know or if anything i might throw in a give, future giveaway hmm. okay and that oh i'm sorry i forgot to say the prices for this mark jacobs thing uh, moisturizer it says well it's kind of like a moisturizer right because it doesn't say it but it kind of says it says, says it right <laughs> okay anyways this is what $59. Um, and then this ice roller 
the Yumujingi here is worth $18. Okay, next item here. Oh, it's from Stila. Which is so funny. Hold on. Stila. Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner. So, uh, well, I'm not going to really read it. It's just an eyeliner, um, which is really funny because I just ran out of this one from, I don't know if it's the same one um, or not, but I have like a little small, oh, this is a brown one though. That's still as much stick waterproof. This is how it looks. Um, you know. Yeah, it's a brown one. Never mind. Okay. I thought it was going to be a black one. Oh, and it's like a metallic. That's nice. I do not mind that. I love metallic glitter. <laughs> it just, it's, it's fun. So I can't wait to try this out. I I thought it was an actual like island eyeliner. I was kind of excited because I really enjoyed the other one. But um, I'm here for it. I'll try this out. Awesome. Next item. I'm getting here. Oh, and that is worth. <laughs> I'm forgetting prices, you guys. Sorry. Uh, that is worth $22, which is kind of pricey-ish. But yeah. Okay, this is a new brand. I've never heard of this one. E.H. Emma Hardy Brilliance Face Oil. Okay, and let's see. Where is it? I'm already brilliant. Okay, this is worth $55. Damn, it says it's for hydrating and lightweight. The brilliance face oil from Emma Hardy Miss massages deep into skin so you can achieve a natural looking glow. Multi active, this formula is crafted with potent essential oils that soothe and pur purify skin. While chameleon, chameleon, chameleon? The oil offers antioxidants protection from free radical damage. Okay. Sounds like this does a lot. <laughs> um, okay. Let's see. Oh, it looks like a getting this. Oh, I think it was kind of dripping a little bit. Um, this is how the bottle looks. It's cute. I'm a very funny person, but I do enjoy doing like a face oil at nighttime and then just wash my face in the morning and put try to avoid oils in the morning. But at nighttime, I do like it. I feel like when I use oils on my face, it just, it feels so smoother, much smoother, and I don't know, somehow my makeup just looks a lot better. But I do use it at nighttime only just because I am oily. And throughout the day, especially during the summer, I'm an oily ass girl here. Because, yeah, I'm just oily. <laughs> and so I will be getting this. Let me see this. How do you open this? Oh, shit. How do you open this? Okay. Okay, you guys. Okay, I'm giving up. I cannot open this up whatsoever. <laughs> oh, damn. It could be because I have, I just touched the oil and the, this, and my hands might, it's too soft. Okay. Damn. Oh, that's hard. Okay, so I'm going to just put this aside. I can't do anything, but, um, okay. I'll try it out. Okay. Did I say the price for that? I don't remember. But that is worth 50 damn. $55. Wow. Nice. Okay. And the next item here is milk. Ooh, milk makeup. Um, this is the second product I've ever received of milk in a box charm box. This little fella a while back. Um, I was thinking about keeping it or giving it away or something, but I ended up keeping it. I tried it and honestly, I didn't really like it. It's like a milk makeup. It's like a blush you can use it as a blush topper it's like a cream you know and um i think that's an you know it's it's an eye shelter or it's a lip like a lip balm kind of thing i don't know quite be i didn't really enjoy it that so much but here you go anyway let's do some makeup what is this um scar oh lip scrub Ooh, i'm wearing lip screen now 
this lip scrub this is how this looks which i do need one so bad i love the packaging by the way it feels like if it's blue see this here like if it's gonna fall out or something right here oh i do feel that little like scrubby thing i have never tried oh and minty i love mint I want the gum <laughs> that feels so good and so satisfying but um i will obviously i swatched it so i'm obviously keeping this because i do need one so badly i ran out of my color pop lip balm like about more than a month ago which i ordered a new one and then they told me they sold out and i was like really supposed to be i ordered it but yeah it sold out and so they refunded me for it, but you know what a bummer. Sorry. Got interrupted by my little one, but I am back now. Okay, so where was I? Oh yeah, the part of the information about the lip scrub. It's milk makeup cut cush lip scrub. An eye exfoliating conditioning lip scrub made with natural sugar crystals and head stem exfoliators for softer, smoother, more moisturized lips. Shea cocoa and mango butter soften lips, seal in moisture, and improve texture. That is so weird because it says that. It doesn't say nothing about, oh, I think that's the head. I don't even think it's me, but it just smells good uh, for me, right? Um, and this is worth $22. So I will be keeping this for sure. My lips do need it. They get quite dry, especially right now that winter is coming in. And I think we have, yeah, one last item. Ooh, they look so nice. I love this packaging. This says The Queen. And this is the brand Eloise Beauty. The Queen Eyeshadow Palette. It's like a, it's not my queen, but nice. I like this packaging. So nice. It kind of looks, nah, it doesn't look like anything else. Similar colors and looks the same. I love this. This is nice. How do you open this? Oh, oh. Okay, so it has a little skinny plastic thing. Oh, and that is how this looks. Okay, this is so nice. It's like half and half, like half matte half um like metallic or glittery i'm a swatch some um okay this one the throne ronnie ring majesty and curtsy let's see oh that's nice you got anything with this not this Oh, that's nice. Let me swatch another one. Uh, I'll put um, I'll do a matte one. Uh, another matte one. Um, Elizabeth. So the swatches here. Oh my god, I suck at doing swatches, you guys. But that's nice. I can't wait to dig into this palette. It looks so cute, and I I love the packaging too. And this is worth. Forty-six dollars. Well, that's twenty shades right there. So I think, depending on how it works, it might be worth it. But we'll see about that later, right? We'll see about that. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see like how this performs, you could check out my Instagram, which I do do more looks over on my Instagram account than here on my channel. But um, yeah, so I might be posting a look with this one of these days soon, this week. But yeah, um, and my information from my Instagram it will be in my in the description box. So if anyone is anyone is interested, you know, just go check it out. Um, um that is all for today, you guys. Um, I will leave the total of this box somewhere around here. Uh, yeah. And I am actually so excited for this box. Except, you know, like, um, just one thing. I'm just like, mm, everything else is pretty exciting. I have not been excited about a boxy charm box 
in such a while i feel like it's always a hit and miss but this month is just such a hit i really i think this is my top favorite one and also the lip scrub because i love lip scrubs but yeah and that is all for today's video you guys thank you all so much if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up or a big like and if you're new also and you enjoyed this don't forget to subscribe as well and i hope everyone is taking care and having a great week bye